when it's summertime, there's no place on the planet quite like the Cape. And when you're hungry, there's no better place on the map quite like the Lobster Trap. Situated on the Back River in Bourne, Massachusetts, the Lobster Trap has been a Cape Cod institution since 1969, starting out as a simple but beloved clam shack. These days, it's anything but, with a big modern dining space complete with a fun bar, a retail market offering the freshest seafood in the area, and an outdoor patio with a view that cannot be beat. You know, it's funny, the Cape does not have enough waterfront dining. We're on the uh, mouth of the Back River, which overlooks Buzz's Bay, so we do have a pretty cool view. We're not open ocean front, but it's kind of that little back river marshy area. I think we got a, got a pretty good spot. Owners Dave and Dan Delancey are the brothers behind this transformation. You'll usually find Dave working the room, making sure everyone is comfortable while Dan heads up the active open kitchen, cooking dishes that go way beyond your average clam shack fare. We're kind of a uh, creative American with a little Asian flair to it. We have a great relationship with some of the boats and stuff like that out in New Bedford. We buy stuff out of Chatham Harbor. So we're buying everything as locally as fresh as we can. We tend to kind of have first dibs on what comes in fresh right off the bat every day. Uh, I can get fish three, four times a day. I think that's what really separates us and makes us kind of unique. <laughs> The appetizer section of the menu offers a little something for everyone. There are tremendous seafood towers loaded up with jumbo shrimp, lobster tails, local oysters, little neck clams, tuna tartare, and wonton chips for dipping. Plus one of the best stuffed quahogs on the Cape, filled with a flavor packed chorizo cornbread stuffing. It's almost like a mix of eating fresh clams and Thanksgiving dinner all at once with a little bit of spice with the chorizo. There are Asian-inspired appetizers like the Thai beef sticks, presented over sticky rice with a seaweed and cucumber salad. It's similar to a beef teriyaki. It's got a little bit of soy, ginger, garlic, some scallions. You know, we marinate them for a day and then just uh, cook them on the grill. So it's got that summery, char-grilled flavor to it, you know, sure to put a smile on your face. Or you can opt for the crab rangoon stuffed with fresh main crab meat and cream cheese and served with a ginger plum dipping sauce. We make all the rangoons in house here. You can taste the crab in it. You can taste the ginger in it. The plum sauce is really good. It's different than just the regular duck sauce you would get at a Chinese restaurant. So I just kind of always want to, you know, create things and elevate things to another level. The sandwiches at the Lobster Trap are also next level. Take, for example, the Surf and Turf Burger. This handheld monster features the best of land and see with an eight ounce burger piled up with fresh lobster meat, lettuce, tomato, cheddar, and pico de gallo, all on a grilled Portuguese muffin. You get that sweet from the Portuguese roll, you get that buttery lobster meat, you get that Angus burger, the pico de gallo, lettuce, tomato, it's a big party in your mouth. Traditionalists will want to go for a Cape classic and order the cod sandwich, made with the freshest fish around on a buttery grilled bun with tartar sauce. Or get crazy and order this mashup of a deli favorite with a Cape Cod staple. So we do a lobster reuben, it's grilled on marble rye, Thousand Islands, Swiss cheese, sauerkraut, and lobster meat. A reuben sandwich is one of my all-time favorite sandwiches. You get the sweetness of the lobster meat, a little bit of bitterness of the sauerkraut, and it really works well together. Of course, a restaurant on the Cape is only as good as its fried seafood platter. And at the Lobster Trap, it's tops. And there's some things that you just can't mess with. And there's nothing better than fresh day boat, dry sea scallops, fresh clams, a little bit of shrimp, some fresh cod, cook everything golden brown and enjoy. Entrees include perfectly seared sea scallops coated in a macadamia cranberry crust and presented over root vegetable risotto with wilted spinach. There are hearty bowls of bolognese and tender steak tips soaked in a hoisin glaze, grilled to perfection and served over pineapple fried rice. But for that true Cape experience, you've got to get yourself something called the bucket. The bucket is basically like a traditional clam bake. It's a pound and a quarter steamed lobster, steamed clams, corn on the cob, some grilled linguiça. There's just something nostalgic about eating a good old fashioned clam bake. And since the lobster trap is open all year round, you don't have to wait until summer to feel all those Cape Cod feels. You know, when people come here, we give them the true Cape Cod dining experience. They're going to get all the local seafood that's available on the Cape. Good service, cook you a good meal, and we're sure to put a smile on your face.